it's official. Baby Jets as Samoajan has retired from international football. We'll look at the statement he released uh, talking about his retirement from the game. After 109 appearances for the Black Stars and 51 goals, he's finally called time officially on his illustrious football career. We'll look at it today. We'll also talk about the Ghana Black Meteors. They played out a 4-1 win over Zamalek youth side earlier today. We'll look at how that game went, the goal scorers there as well. As usual, subscribe if you have not. Click on the notification bell to get more updates. So Baby Jet Asamwajan, that's the breaking news. He has retired from international football. Remember, in 2022, in the lead up to the World Cup, he spoke with the BBC and sp said that he feels young and feels that he can also take part in the World Cup. Uh, Otoado was questioned on that and uh, we know what happened next. Uh, he was not invited to the team after years of a, a back and forth on his retirement. He's officially made it official that he is no longer uh, going to play football he has retired now this is the statement he posted and uh, officially as i end my speech mr president ministers of state uh, members of the board uh, fellow speakers nananom i want to take this great opportunity a stage that is difficult in every footballer's career a moment all footballers do not wish but when nature dawns that thin voice will keep echoing into the ears. It is time. The voice has been clear in my ears and I have succumbed to it. It is time, it is time, it is time to hang the jersey and boots in glory as I retire officially from active football. But then again, I am minded by views shared by great businessmen and sporting gurus. You do not leave your lab. Together with my management, we will continue encouraging and pushing young talent as we did recently with the Baby Jet Under 16 competition. Where 1,200 young players across West Africa exhibited their talent on live TV. Again, I will put my experience and knowledge to use in the field of coaching, football, business, and scouting. I want to thank my beloved country Ghana, my family, my colleagues from school, those from the Colts and Black Stars from 2002 to date, the club mates, coaches and everyone who has played a role in my career as a footballer. I say thank you, may God bless you. And that was the statement issued by Baby Jet Asamoah He was a speaker at an event uh, being held uh, earlier on today. It was the uh, football talk. Didier Drogba and Co were here for this talk. Uh, it was a sports uh, as a new creative industry opportunity for inclusive youth. Insights from professionals, Baby Jetta Samwajan and also Didier Drogba. So Baby Jet has officially retired uh, from football. He will, however, be using his expertise to help the up and coming talent to nurture talent as he did in the baby jet under 16 tournament over 1200 participants in that competition uh, hopefully he does help the black stars as well because i have already said that goal scoring is a problem and uh, having an assistant coach to help the strikers in baby jet as someone would be so so amazing and helpful I hope the FA look at it and call on Asamoah to help the national team as he did when he was playing officially for them. Baby Jet, you've done your part. Congratulations to you. Happy retirement. Uh, the Black Meteors uh, played today. Uh, they won 4-1, a hat-trick uh, for Yabua. He got a hat-trick. And the fourth one was added later on. The Black Meteors wrapped up uh, their uh, training tour. The 4-1 victory of Egyptian club side Zamalek. The National Under-23 have been in Egypt since June 12 as they prepare for the AFCON Under-23. Uh, Emmanuel Yeboah's hat-trick and Emmanuel Apau were Ghana's goal scorers in Tuesday's match which was played at the Zamalek Sports Complex. 
Ghana shot into the lead just after 10 minutes with Emmanuel Yeboa slotting home to beat Zamalek goalkeeper. The Zamalek side uh, with which was made up which was made up, made of some best team and reserve team players uh, quickly rallied back and got the equalizer after five minutes. Yeboa scored again in the 25th minute to restore Ghana's lead after a brilliant build-up play. With about five minutes to half time, Emmanuel got his hat trick with a rebound uh, before Emmanuel Apao added Ghana's fourth on the day. Goalkeeper uh, Jordan Emisa pulled up a spectacular save after Zamalek were awarded a penalty just before the break. The second half saw coach Ibrahim Tanko making some substitutions as he's Dari, Randolph, and Poku Wari all coming on in the second half. Despite dominating the game in the second half, Ghana failed to add to their goal tally with the game ending 4-1. The team is expected to leave this its training base in Cairo on Wednesday tomorrow, 21st of June, and continue their preparations in Rabat, Morocco. Ghana will take on Congo in their opening game on the 25th of June, 3 p.m. GMT is the kickoff time. The Black Meteors will then take on Who's Morocco in the second group game on the 27th. At the final group game for Ghana will be versus Guinea at the Grand Star de Tanger. The best two teams from Group A and B uh, will advance to the semi-final stage of the competition, winner of the tournament, and the two runner-ups uh, will qualify for the Tokyo 20. 24 Olympic Games. So congratulations the Black Meteors. Great way to round up uh, the preparations. Some would say it's not quality opposition, but they had one tough one versus the Egyptian on the 23 side. Had a draw uh, with a lowly side as compared to what Ghana is capable of. It's not a bad um, run out uh, to test themselves. Jordan Emis are doing well. Another penalty save. These two goalkeepers have shown they are competent enough who will get the number one slot for the Ghana Black Meteors when they kick things off this Sunday, 25th, 3 p.m. GMT, the kickoff time for that tournament, for Ghana at least. The tournament kicks off on the 24th of June in Morocco. Morocco versus uh, Guinea will kick things off, Ghana, Congo on Sunday. So that has been it for today. Baby Jetta Samwajan has officially retired from international football an illustrious career spanning 109 appearances for the Ghana Black Stars, 51 goals, Ghana's highest goal scorer to date. He has left a great legacy behind. He will still be nurturing talent as he has done at the under 16 Baby Jets under 16 tournament. And the Black Meteors and preparations for the tournament with a win, a 4 1 win versus Samalek youth side, composed of reserve players and some of the youth team players as well. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy your day. <laughs>